Our oldest growth species in the province may actually be grasses, not trees. Some of these grasslands date back to glaciation and even prior to glaciation. They provide the majority of the forage in the winter for cattle, also for bison operations, and then for wildlife. So grasslands are basically a critical component of our life in Alberta. These species with their slow growth pattern, infrequent seed set, and then their really extremely poor germination rates has made them very difficult to restore. Conventional wisdom has been that once you destroy a fescue grassland, you will never get it back. Initially, we were in agreement with that. With close to 15, 20 trials on our own, we had one success. Really, the secret came when we started looking at, well, how do we grow trees? And so we started isolating in the greenhouse the perfect growing conditions for those plants. And now we're able to, in a four month period, produce a two year old um, sized plant that would have been grown in the wild. We can preserve as much as possible, but at the same time, if we do not restore these ecosystems and protect them through restoration, we're gonna find that they're slowly pieced off into little tiny unsustainable areas that can't be protected or sustained in the long term.